You know, there actually is a 401k that I would participate in. So one of my clients is a state defense attorney. She's a government employee. And if you look at the qualified plan that she has, it's referred to as a non-contributory plan, meaning the state will fund her retirement account to the tune of just over 15% every year of her pay, 15%. Now here's the kicker. They don't require her to contribute her own money. That's what's referred to as a non-contributory plan. You see, it does not require her own capital. Now, I gotta tell you, if somebody was willing to do that for me, heck yeah, I'd let them do it. If someone said, you know what, Kelly, man, I love you, I just think you're awesome, and I wanna put 15% of your annual pay into an account that you don't own and control, the government can tax it later at any rate they want, you don't know what the terms are gonna be, but we're gonna set that aside because we think you're awesome. I mean, seriously, I don't care if I'd only get 10% of it later, that's free money. I would absolutely sign up for that. However, if they were to then say, but Kelly, we're gonna need you to contribute your money into this as well. Well, see, that's a different leveraging model. Now this is requiring my money to leave me to then go into the account with all those rules and all those regulations and without any of the control and with unknown taxes. Well, I don't know if I wanna put my capital into that. So believe it or not, that's where your mind has to go when you're thinking about how to maximize your 401k and your match. You want to take as much of their money as possible that your employer will contribute and put the least amount of your money into the account as possible in order to get that match. So for example, if your employer gives 6% and they only required you to do 1%, well, that's the best leverage of that free money. If it's zero from you and the 6% from them is the absolute best, the non-contributory, like the government does with their own people, like my client who's the attorney, then the smaller amount from you to get that big match is exactly how you mathematically maximize these. It isn't by contributing the maximum allowable. That's an over leverage of your money. So I'm all for the non-contributory. If I don't have that, I'm all for the smallest amount possible to get the biggest contribution from the employer. After that, man, you're just playing with, well, the likes of the mafia. They get to control your capital. No thanks. So again, the alternative and the far better alternative is adding into your overall plan insurance contracts. And we can show you how to do that. If you find this valuable, please follow and leave a comment for me. And don't forget, God loves you. And the way that you live your life matters because you're establishing how you're gonna be living with him later. So know that you're blessed, know that you're loved, and have a great day.